Hi you guys and thank you so much for tuning into my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a home chef unboxing and I'm also going to tell you what the difference is that I've seen from home chef versus HelloFresh and why I canceled HelloFresh after over three years. If you're interested in knowing what my thoughts are going to be and what's going to be in this box, stay tuned. Okay, you guys, so today is my delivery date for my home chef box. You get to choose the date that it is delivered. And I'm going to basically, I'm gonna unbox this for you. I'm gonna show you how this comes. And then I'm gonna let you know the difference between HelloFresh and Home Chef, in my opinion, and why I ended up switching after over three years of being with HelloFresh. So let's go ahead and start with Home Chef. I do have them linked down below. If you use my link, you will definitely get money off of your first box if you are interested in bringing fresh, wonderful, good food to your home and staying safe inside. So this is the box. This is how it comes. So let's go ahead and get this open so we can see what's inside. So let's go ahead and get it opened. Let's get cooking. <laughs> So when you first open it up, you will have this little envelope that goes over special offers that are inside. They're always different little coupons that you can look through if you would like. There's like a wine voucher, but I don't keep any of that stuff. Now their cards, this is the first time I've received the card on the top. Normally the cards are just tucked into the side like this in the very first box. I didn't realize that. So I didn't have my cards because I left them in the box. So always check for your cards. This is going to be the three different cards for my meals. We'll go over those in just a second. And then when you open it up, it is this insulated box. The bags come like this, they're in plastic bags. And then when you pull all of them out, down inside of here is going to be where the frozen, like the little freezer ice packs are. And then there's more under there with the meat. So here's all of the meats. You can just pull this out. It's already in a bag and you can put it in the refrigerator. And then everything else in here, I just end up throwing away and that's it. Okay, you guys. So now I'm going to go over pretty much the differences that I have seen so far from HelloFresh versus Home Chef. So now again, Home Chef comes in these clear plastic bags. HelloFresh would come in a brown paper bag there was no ventilation or anything like that so I kind of feel now that I have this one in clear plastic bags and they have little holes for ventilation that's throughout the bag on both sides there's little holes and now I'm thinking that maybe one of the reason why my vegetables were <laughs> not so fresh maybe is because they didn't have any ventilation I'm not quite sure but all I know is everything comes way fresher and <laughs> It's a lot easier. Now with HelloFresh, I would always use their bag after I take everything out. I would use the bag to put all of my trash in. Anything that was like, you know, if you're cutting stuff off, the stems, the packaging, ever, all my trash I would toss in there. So when I'm done cooking, I just roll that up and throw it in the trash. I can still do the same thing with these plastic bags, which is perfectly fine. And I just realized <laughs> that they have what it is here. I'm always like, how do I know the difference? Because the other one had a big sticker on the bag so you knew what was inside. I didn't know, but here is the little sticker right there that tells you what it is. So again, everything comes like this in this little bag and all of the meat comes like this. Now with HelloFresh, every single time I would unbox it, I would grab all of the meat because as you can tell, there's liquid in there. That's just what happens. But I would grab all of the meat and stick it in my own Ziploc bag and put it in the refrigerator. So one good thing that I really, really like about Home Chef and I noticed right out of my first box is they already have them in bags. So I don't have to waste Ziploc bags anymore because they already come in the bags. So now like down inside this one, here is going to be some beef. I have some fish and my other meal must be, my other meal must be vegetarian or there's no meat. Oh, it has prosciutto in it. So it's already in the package. Because <laughs> normally you get three things of meat. Well, I choose three days, but I'll get into all of that in just a second. Let me stick my meat in the fridge. <laughs> Let me put my meat in the fridge. <laughs> so now I wanna show you what basically comes in each bag. So again, they're like this. 
So this is going to be the card for that mill. Now their cards, another thing that I noticed is they have holes punched in already to go into a notebook. My ones from HelloFresh are right here. <laughs> and when I said I was with HelloFresh for over three years, these are all of my recipe cards for over three years. And the last video that I did from HelloFresh, I explained to you guys that I wanted to go through these and put these in order by what type of meat they are and poke holes in them and put them in a binder. No holes poking needed on these. They're already ready for you. So now that I'm not using HelloFresh anymore, now I have no excuse. I'm gonna go through all these. I'm gonna pull out all the duplicates and I'm gonna organize these and put these in a book like I intended on doing. Okay, you guys, I'm finally doing it. I'm actually going through and organizing all these. Now that I pulled them all out, <laughs> I'm organizing them and I'm gonna get this done. How are you spending your Friday night? Cause this is what I'm doing. They have the same type of card instructions, very simple step-by-step -step instructions on telling you how to cook everything. One thing I do like about Home Chef is that this one literally tells you how many days to cook within. It tells you the time for prepping, it tells you the difficulty level, and if it is spicy. Hello Fresh would say the prep time, would say the calories, and would say the total time. But it didn't have anything about spiciness, difficulty level, how many days to actually cook that meal or anything. So I really appreciate that this tells me how many days to use. So when I get my cards, I'll basically put them in order by how many days I need to use them. So four days, six days, and this one is three days. So of course I wanna cook the third three day one first because this one needs to be used first. Now on the back, it will go over all of the simple instructions. Again, step-by-step -step instructions, same with the HelloFresh. So their cards are very easy to use, very user-friendly and very self-explanatory. So now for this particular one, this is the steak and potato tacos. This one is gonna come with flour, tortillas, red grape tomatoes. You have queso fresco. And then here is this jar. This jar is, these look like these are potatoes. And these jars, you guys, I actually reuse. I pull the little, because underneath will be a piece of paper, like underneath that lid. I'll remove that and clean these and dry them and I'll reuse them. I've gotten several different sizes down to teeny tiny ones to bigger ones. And I really like that you can keep these. They're good to reuse it for anything. You can put it in for leftovers if you have some type of like a liquid or anything like that. So you can reuse these. So I like that they have reusable containers. This one also is gonna come with fresh pesto. Here is some seasoning mix and the last thing in this particular meal kit is sour cream. So then that is everything that they would send for this particular meal. Okay, so like this next meal, look at this. They even sent in mashed potatoes. There's already mashed potato. What in the world is this one? Is this the soup? I think this is the soup. Yes, this is the crispy prosciutto loaded baked potato soup, you guys. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. So this one comes with prosciutto, which looks really good. There's the mashed potatoes. There is some green onion, sour cream. There's cheese, a whole lot of potatoes. There's garlic, seasonings, all of this stuff for you to make your potato soup. And if you did watch my HelloFresh, my friend reminded me because she just watched it and she was like, I'm gonna sign up for HelloFresh. I'm like, no, 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 please don't. <laughs> You home chef <laughs> and she was like I watched your video and you had the tiny little cucumber it looked like a pickle and I had a carrot that you can bend and bow. it was so limp and that's a lot of the carrots that I would receive from them if I didn't cook that meal within one to two days from hello fresh it was not fresh anymore and they were definitely bent so I knew I had to cook things you know right away but it was still good to me because I was getting food delivered. I was learning how to cook new things. I was being introduced to new food and all of that. So I loved my food subscription box, but I get all of that plus more with this one, Home Chef, because it tastes so much better. So let me go ahead and just toss these in the refrigerator really quick. And then I'm gonna let you know a little bit more deciding factors on why I know for a fact I'm gonna stick with this company. Hold on. Okay, so. The packaging alone. This packaging is a lot smaller. I don't have my HelloFresh box because again, I don't get it anymore. But the HelloFresh box would be a whole lot bigger. 
it was always leaking and oozing out whatever in the world was inside of the box, probably from the frozen pack that's in there. But almost every single HelloFresh box that I received would be completely leaking some type of a liquid. And it's very unpleasant. Plus, not to mention, it's a bigger box to take up more room in my trash can where this one doesn't take up as much room. So I do like that I'm not using a whole lot of space in my trash can until trash day with their boxes like I was with HelloFresh. Now with this company, I don't know if they do this type of shipping for everywhere um, through the whole US. I'm not sure. If you guys have tried Home Chef and you got the same type of delivery, let me know in the comment section below because I would really like to know if that's who they use everywhere or if it's just in my local area. But they use, which I believe is called Blue Streak. Now, my delivery date is on Thursday. Every Monday without fail, first thing in the morning, I will get an email notification stating they have my package information. If I have any specific, anything about my delivery, I can reply and tell them. So for example, around the holidays when my work would close early, I would then say, you know, hey, we're closing early for the holidays. I'm only gonna be there until 12 o'clock. So they would put a note in there. They had all week, the note was in there. And then on that day, they would deliver it before 12 o'clock. One time there was a little bit of something, a hiccup, the driver got delayed and it was gonna be after 12. So they actually delivered it to my home. It's not much farther, but they delivered it to my home that day. So I didn't have to just sit there and wait for them just sitting at work <laughs> with the clothes. <laughs> so I really, really appreciate that the company that they're using for the shipping is very flexible and sends you so many notifications. So then the day of you get your order is gonna be delivered today. You get another, you get text messages as well. I get text notifications saying that it's in route. When it's delivered, I get it's delivered and there's a picture of it, it's at my door or whichever it ends up being at. They are just, I don't know, their shipping, at least for my area, is just spot on and I have no complaints whatsoever <laughs> with their shipping. <laughs> with HelloFresh, the only thing that I am missing, and I'm not gonna lie, the only thing that I am missing here is when you would go to order your meals, you could add on different things. Like you can add on a salad that would come with the dressing and like um, some fruit and nuts to put on top, that kind of thing. Like it would be a complete salad mix kit that you can purchase in addition. You can purchase lunch meals. You can purchase, there's bread, like a, like a uh, bread that had garlic, garlic and butter. It was really, really good, but you can get the bread. You can even get like the cookies. You know, the ones you can buy at the store that are already done. You just put on the pan and stick them in the oven. You can buy those. They had the same type of concept in brownies. Um, they just had, oh, avocados. Like when they were in season, you can buy like a bag of avocados, which I really loved. So I loved those add-ons. With Home Chef, they don't have those type of add-ons right now anyway. I don't know if that's something they're gonna do in the future, but they do have where you can add on extra meats. So they have they do have a add-on option, but it's to get like a set of different type of meats delivered with your box. So they have that, which I don't mind. I'll just go to the store and get my own salad and avocados and stuff like that. It was just more convenient when it came in my box, but I will take this company's better tasting food over that convenience <laughs> any day. So with HelloFresh, you could choose all of the different meals. They had tons of ones to offer, which I did appreciate, but that particular meal, you could not customize anything about it. That's what you received if that's the meal that you had chose. Now with Home Chef, what I really, really like is you have an option to customize it so you can change the meat. So let's just say hypothetically, you saw something that was like a pretzel, honey Dijon crusted tilapia, and you're like, I don't like fish but I would like that with chicken. Then you can customize it and change it to chicken. Or if there's like a beef meal and you wanna change it to turkey meat or chicken, you can do that. Some of the meats, if they're more premium or prime type of a meat, you'll pay a little bit more for and it tells you before you check it. But if it's, a, if it's a comparable switch, like turkey meat, chicken, there's no additional charge to change it. And then when you get your cards, it'll say if you substituted it for this or for that. So you have still all of the cooking information based on, so right here, here's customized instructions. So for this particular meal, if I used chicken or the sirloin or the filet mignon, that tells me how to cook it, or I would just cook it normally if I did the salmon. So I really like that because 
I like that. I like that you can change the meat if you so chose to. That I have done that a few times. Now, another thing that I really, really like about Home Chef is not only do they have the same type of meals like HelloFresh, where they give you everything that you need, you cut them up, you cook it, you do everything yourself, but they also have some that are like a quick and easy meal kit, and it even will come like in an ovy, ovy. <laughs> No, an oven ready pan. It's a throwaway pan when you're done, but it's easy cleanup. You don't have to use your own pan and have to wash that. And everything comes pre-cut up that week. This week I didn't have one of those meals. I didn't choose one. I like to one of my meals choose one of those. So if it's a day where I'm running behind, I have a lot of things to do. I can just toss that in and get that going without having to prep and do everything on my own. So I like having that option of an easy meal kit. Now, the different types of meals they have are the oven ready, fast and fresh, the meal kits, and then they have culinary collections. Now, their meal kits range from $8.99 per person to $13.99. So the pricing is pretty much comparable with HelloFresh as well, but Home Chef, at least as of right now, they are charging shipping. I was in charge of shipping with HelloFresh because I was kind of grandfathered in. I had my subscription for over three years, so I was locked into my original pricing. But once I had canceled, now they do charge delivery from what I had seen on their website, I do believe. But I do like that they have some down to $8.99 where I believe HelloFresh, their meal started at $10 a person. So some of them can be cheaper depending on which meals that you choose. Now, one other thing that I noticed is HelloFresh would have a minimum of three days. I don't know if they changed that or not. Again, I was always grandfathered in, so I never changed my account. But with this one, you can do two days. If you wanna try this and only do two meals out of the week, you most certainly can. Your options are two meals per week, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. I didn't just keep counting and go to eight. They go up to eight. So I guess if you wanted to have like lunch meals in between or extra meals, you can go up to eight meals per week delivered. Crazy. And your serving size is for two, for four, or for six. Now, again, I do like that if you wanted to try this out and you only wanted to start with two meals a week just to try it, I like that you can do that. They both also have an easy to use app. So if you do get it, I would highly suggest downloading the app because you can go through, you can see all of your weeks, you can skip a week if you would like, you can see all of the different meals. It's so much easier through the app, I feel, and I use the app with HelloFresh as well. So that's another thing that they pretty much have the same of, which is an easy user-friendly app to check everything out. And you can, like I said, you can skip your weeks, you can cancel at any time, you're not stuck into a commitment, but they do charge you like a week in advance. So for example, today is my delivery date, so today they're gonna charge me now for next week. So always know you're pretty much paying a week in advance. So if you do want to cancel or anything, make sure you cancel or you skip your week so they don't charge you for those weeks. One other thing, which is another kind of, it's kind of a big thing to me because it just seems like they just take more care into their boxes and about us and what they send to us than the other company did. So with Home Chef, another big thing that I noticed is when a recipe calls for butter, they actually send the butter. HelloFresh never sent butter. If it's, if you need to like fry something, not if you're just cooking with oil where it says add a couple teaspoons or tablespoons, that they don't send. But if you're actually frying something, let's say you're gonna be frying some pieces of fish, cause that's what I did the other day. It was like mahi mahi that I had to fry up. Um, they sent a big long thing of the canola oil. So you don't even need to worry about that either. And the other day I had a meal where there was like a pastry, I don't know what you call it, it was like pastry dough, it was like a square of like a pastry dough and you cut it up into four strips and then you put, it was like mayonnaise that you mix with water, like a little bit of water to make like a little, I don't know, you dusted it on it and then you put on some Parmesan cheese on both sides and you twisted it and you baked it. I don't think I've ever had a pastry taste so good before, it was so, airy and crisp and it was just amazing and then one meal that i did let me let me let me show you which meal this was because i am definitely going to make sure it was this one right here i think it was this one i think it was this one right here yes and it had snow peas onions and broccoli however they had me prepare these vegetables i didn't even care about this 
I wanted to eat the vegetables. And speaking of vegetables, they send a whole lot more vegetables than HelloFresh ever did. That night, more than half of both of our plates were completely filled with the vegetables. Trust me, I wasn't minding. I was sad when my vegetables were gone. They were so good. They're so crisp and fresh and just the flavorings that they did was just amazing. Another meal that I did, it came with rice and the rice was already cooked, you guys. I, again, I don't mind cooking rice at all, but that was one of the quicker meals and it already had the seasoning in it. It was just amazing. It was perfectly cooked. It tasted like it was freshly cooked. Like their ingredients are just 100% more fresh. They're they're better tasting, their seasonings are different. HelloFresh has their own distinctive like seasonings. It's like, it was like a repeated seasoning. I, we were constantly tasting the same thing. A lot of ginger, a lot of like the same type of seasonings, no matter what I'm cooking. If it's a hamburger, meatloaf, if it's a fish thing, if it's a taco night or whatever it was, it always had the same type of taste to it. With Home Chef, it is so flavorful and it's always different flavors because it's different meals. It's not like all repeated flavors in my mouth. And I really, 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 really do love that. With HelloFresh, their, their meat, the, um, the ground beef, every time I tried, and I've even tried throughout the whole three years, I'll sneak a meal in every now and then trying to do a meal with the ground beef. And my man would pull out more ground beef than he actually ate because of all of the fat. He's very, very picky with his meat. He's picky in general, but he's very, very picky with his meat and he knows what he likes and that's what he wants. And so their meat, basically, I had to stop getting any meals from HelloFresh that had ground beef. And if they would have had the option to substitute it for like ground turkey meat, that would have been a whole lot better because then I would have been able to have those meals like this company does. So I've already tried, I think every week I've gotten something with ground beef in it because I wanted to try their beef to see if we're gonna have the same problems. And he's never pulled any, anything out of his mouth. He's eaten it all and he loves it. So I don't know what kind of meat the other company was using, but I'm so glad that this company has fresh and quality items down to the meats, the seasoning, the vegetables, everything. So you guys, that's pretty much all that I can think of to say right now between the difference between the two. I'm just so, so happy that I finally took the plunge and canceled HelloFresh and found a different company because I really wish I would have found this company three years ago, but then I never would have known the big difference and I can now appreciate this new company more knowing all of the difference the differences that they have between each other. And I love this one so much better. Again, I will link them down below if you would like to check them out. It will save you money off of your first box if you would like to. I definitely love this. I loved my HelloFresh when I was getting it because of the simple fact that I was getting fresh food delivered to my door. I'm so glad that I can continue that with a better company, with better products, better tasting food, better ingredients, and just all around a better company down to their customer service, their shipping, everything about this company so far is just like, where have you been all my life? <laughs> so I'm so, so glad that now I do have them. You guys comment down below, have you ever tried a home delivery fresh food service before? If so, which one? What was your experience? What were your thoughts on it? Again, I'm not gonna go back to HelloFresh, no. No, I'm not. I've already deleted the app off my phone. I'm completely done with that one. And this is the only one that I'm going to be using from this point forward. So yeah. So again, you guys comment down below. Your positive interaction means the world and I greatly do appreciate it. As I greatly appreciate every single one of you guys. So until next time, you know that drill. Keep a smile on that gorgeous face of yours and I'll see you on the next one. <laughs> Bye. Crafty Crew, out.